Hello everyone and welcome to my let's play of Cursory, The Crooked Man and the Crooked Cat. It's a hidden object game slash adventure game and I am so excited to bring this out to you guys. This is one of my favorite games, like my top 20 favorites. Not only are the graphics beautiful, but like the entire game and the story is just fantastic. And I just, I can't wait for you guys to enjoy it with me. I've played this numerous times and every, every playthrough never gets boring. So we're just going to get right into it. Enjoy. Let's see. I will do normal. Because I want you guys to enjoy the story. And I also just want to enjoy the story because it's amazing. So here we go. the story about the kidnapped maidens apparently all the girls were around my age they all vanished while traveling down this path what was that <laughs> are you all right <laughs> oh no you don't and there he goes so that was the opening Renee's shoe she must have dropped it during the struggle there are bats everywhere. Fire seems to keep the creatures at bay, but for how much longer? In this dark maze, we hang on by a thread, with a little oil left in the lamp. These are the bats. I'll take that. A shadow etching of a man and a cat. It can't be a coincidence, but the words are too eroded to be s to be legible. The tree seems to be trying to hide something from view. Can I use these? Nope. A small trinket chest has an empty depression in the shape of a bat. I'll take this. Pepper. I got pepper. So if anybody's new to hidden object games, basically you pick up items, you solve puzzles, and you read notes. And you also travel from place to place. See? An old bunny doll. A child must have lived here once. I'll take that. Hey, how'd you get in there? Little guy? I'll get you out. The locked wooden box with the elaborate sheep engravings is gear missing from the side panel. Briars seem to be curled protectively around a large box of some sort. I wonder what it is. A beast is hiding in the bushes. I need something that causes a burning sensation to drive it away. I have a match. That helps. White rose blooms among the briars and brambles. A beauty that makes their cruelty hard to resist. An elegant angel statue sits incredulously among the briars. She looks so grave, as if she carries the weight of a thousand sorrows. Hmm. I don't think Pepper is going to get you out of there, little guy. Let's see. I have a winding key, a box with one match. <laughs> I can't do that. I might start a forest fire. Hey, it never hurts to try. Okay, so... Oh, 
Okay, so I don't think I can do that with that. Okay. I'm missing something here. It can't be that. Yeah, take that. Thank you for saving my little lamb. I am Marianne. As a reward for your bravery, I will tell you what I know about the crooked man. He is the one who kidnapped your sister. There once was a young noble who fell in love with a common village girl. Unfortunately, the girl died before they could get married. Deep grief overwhelmed the noble, and he fell into madness. In his insanity, he became convinced that his fiancée would be reincarnated one day. He started to kidnap maidens of a similar age to his dead fiancées. None of the maidens were ever seen again. If you wish to save your sister, you must defeat the crooked man once and for all. Otherwise, he will just keep coming after her. To help you, I will give you this magical map. It will automatically record the locations of the places you have visited. If you have need of me, I will try to send help. Thank you, Marianne. That was extraordinary, but how did she know about the Crooked Man? And where did she get a magical map? I don't know, but I think this is the map. It sure is. Oh, well, that's cool. Isn't that neat? Oh, I love this game. It's so great. Okay. The path is still not cleared. The lamb has returned to its owner. I wonder who she was. So I have this map now, and there's something here. When it has an area of interest, it means there's something here. Can't cut them yet. Oh look! Oh, I didn't even see this. White lamb here. Oh, I know where you go. You sure do. Ooh, look, a puzzle. The wee little lamb cannot count. But it can help you find the exact amount. Okay, so one, two, five, six, seven, eight, six. Nope. Nope. Five, six, seven. Five. Nope, none of these. Let's see, there's five, six, seven. There we go. Five. Doing good so far. Um, let's see. All of these are right. This one belongs where are you, eight? Right here. No, we're six. There it is. No, you silly thing. Oh, no. Okay. Okay, sometimes you have to mess up in order to get the right amount. So, eight. Okay, got it. Okay, so eight corresponds with these. Bam. Bam. Okay, and then number two. I did it! And... 
Okay. I will give the cheese to the mouse. And I'll give the uh, carrots to the bunny. Sure will. And then the bananas. These are bananas, right? Oh. I will give the caterpillar leaves. The butterfly flowers. I will give the cat fish. And I'll give the monkey bananas. And I'll give the rooster. Ah. Uh, What are they? Worms? Oh, those are worms. Silly me. <gasps> Alright. An oil-soaked rag hangs from the mouth of the bottle. If I light it, I can make an explosive weapon. Hmm. <gasps> I did it. What's this? A hidden cachet with a prominent fleur de lieu de decoration is locked tight. There is an empty slot that needs an item. This? No. We might have to come back. Bombs away, guys! Yeah, use this. <laughs> Alright. Give me back my sister. Day one, 8 p.m. A storage cellar has been chained shut. A lady like Duck, a companion to the soldier, sits patiently by the cabinet as if waiting for someone's return. I'll take that. What's this? An old heartwarming portrait of a woodcutter and his child. It must have been painted at least a hundred years ago. This looks like they need doorknobs, so let's go look for some doorknobs. With the door with the intricate cross-shaped pattern is locked, but there is a keyhole. Hmm. What's over here? Shoo, shoo! A flock of nasty-looking crows are pecking away at something. How do I chase them off? I got a stick. Oh, it's a twig, actually. There's something in the treehouse, but it's out of my reach. Is there a tool that could help me? Ooh, look, I know where you go. Oh, another puzzle. The bunnies are trying to trick the wolves with a ruse. Make sure the wolves end up surrounded and lose. Uh-oh. Okay, so... The bunnies are trying to trick the wolves with a ruse. Make sure the wolves end up surrounded. Got it. So put the wolves in the middle. Don't worry, don't worry, I got it. Alright. Hmm. Got it. <laughs> I had to concentrate on that one. Hello. The rabbit ear jack-in-the-box is guaranteed to make any child smile. I'll take that. Old Mother Goose, when she wanted to wander, would ride through the air on a very fine gander. Okay. So I got a cabinet. A stark ch chalk drawing in a child's hand. It says, watch out for the crooked man, he's coming. Hmm. Formerly attired scarecrow is oddly reminiscent of someone. Yeah, the crooked man. Alright, well I have a twig. I have a crooked sixpence. Which I think is money. Pretty sure. I hate to think what that head is up to on its own. There's no head. The tattered abused puppet is strapped to the gate like a shield. Hello, what's that? An eagle whistle. 
The M engraving has a gear mechanism with an array of crooked coins in the slots. Two of the slots are empty. Okay, so we're gonna need slots for that. Ooh. Thanks, Mr. Duck. Dragonfly Jewel. This gnarled old tree seems sturdy enough to hold my weight. If I could chop it down, I can use it. What's this? Run! The crooked man haunts this forest. He is always watching. A weathered old poster. It seems to be a guide to dangerous animals. This could be useful. Okay, so the whistle... <gasps> the crow! Ah, got it. Ah, oh, yeah. Oh, wrong way. <laughs> I wonder who this skeleton was. Something seems to be clasped tightly in his hand. <gasps> I didn't even notice it was a skeleton. Oh, my. What's this? Is that a ghost? Take my pocket watch and give it to Amelie, my fiance. Please, I beg of you, save Amelie from the crooked man. That must have been the ghost of this poor man. His fiance was also snatched by the crooked man. All right, I'll do it. Oh, that looks like my sister. What a pretty girl. She must be the Amelie he mentioned. Was she kidnapped like my sister? We got another sixpence. And a pocket watch. Hmm. I'm just gonna put that right there. I got a doorknob. A fo- Ooh! I know where this goes. Aha! Remember? Sometimes we have to backtrack. Aw, but come on. It should go there. It's a doorknob. Take it. Alright, alright. Hmm. Here? Oh, look. I didn't even notice these. Open sesame, I suppose. I'll take that. Thank you very much. The bunny lies half hidden, as if abandoned by a frightened child. I'll take that. Thank you. It looks like you need a bell. So when I find one, I'll come and give it. <gasps> yes. For days I've been trapped in this fog, and the trees themselves seem to come alive right before my eyes. I don't know if I'll ever find my way out. Oh boy. Okay. The lockbox is decorated with a buffalo motif. I need appropriate item for the empty slot. Hmm. Okay, so it looks like that's gonna be a maze for me. Ah, oh, yeah. Click to make the ducks hop. Match the pattern at the top. Okay. Um, this is the pattern. Right? No? Wrong pattern? Ah. Ducks are facing the wrong way. Okay. So, this one? Ta-da! And then this one. Ta da! And then. Ducks. No, I need the other one. Ta da! Ladder. Thanks. I needed that. Yeesh. That would have been bad. Oh, The cabinet suddenly collapsed. 
Maybe the ladder was all that was holding it up. Probably. Alright, so we're gonna get into here. Ta-da! Ooh, I can take that. Thank you very much. And, uh, looks like this is gonna need a star. The colorful star started toy house. It's missing a plaque for the door. Yeah, I don't think I have anything. Nope. Nothing. I'm sad. Okay. Well, we'll be back. But we have an axe. Aha! Success! Now I can cross the stream. Sweet. Okay, so let's do it. <gasps> there he is! The crooked man. I'm not losing him this time. Hey, give me back my sister. Gosh darn it. <laughs> the crooked man disappeared into the tree with Renee. Ugh. My sister's shoe. I'm coming, Renee. I sure am. And I missed all this area, too. And we'll figure out how to get my sister back in the next episode, guys. I hope you like this. Tell me what you guys think. If you want to see more, go ahead and just leave in the comments. Um, you can go ahead and feel free to like or subscribe. Um, I'll be playing lots of different games. I tried playing Alice Mare, uh, but the resolution was just, like, horrible. I, I couldn't do it. So I think I'll be playing another RPG Maker soon. Um, I've got one more video coming up today, and that's going to be a one-shot demo. And this will be my Let's Play until I finish. And then after that, I think I'll be playing Force of the Drizzling Rain. So thank you guys so much, and I will see you next time. Bishi out.